Dear friends, God wants us to be holy, to be saints. This is God's will for you and for me. It's his plan for every person. It is the whole truth about our lives. It is the whole truth about the world and about history. Our challenge is to believe in this plan, to trust in Jesus and to believe in his love for us. And yes, our faith has been tested. Since last Lent, we have seen our lives disrupted by the coronavirus. But God is in charge. What we cannot understand today, we will understand tomorrow. The scandal of evil, the innocent who suffer, the hardships that we and our loved ones must endure. In everything, God is working according to his mysterious and loving purposes. So let us entrust ourselves more and more to his tender care and seek more and more to do his will in everything. And as we continue our Lenten journey for a second year under the shadow of a global pandemic, I invite you to join me and renew our trust in the Lord, to strengthen our confidence in God's personal love for each one of us. Trust in his word, trust in his steadfast love, his mercy, his saving power. We cannot rely on ourselves. God alone must be our rock and our refuge, our help and our shield. My friends, the best way to grow in trust is through prayer. Try to make little acts of faith and throughout the day, pray this simple and powerful prayer. Sacred Heart of Jesus, I trust in you. Remember, Jesus will never abandon you. Please pray for me this Lent and I will pray for you.